Emotionally, it just felt like my life was a little bit scattered and I didn't really know what to do. The hardest part of it all was I was freshly out of culinary school, ready to start my career, and my goal was three days away from leaving to go to college halfway across the country. I felt overwhelmed. I felt sad. I felt stressed. It was just a bunch of emotions in coming to my head. I already have three kids, so for another one to come in this world and knowing that I don't have my life together, I'm not in a stable place. I was looking up different resources to help out single moms. I was about two, three months pregnant when I found them. I just wanted to see if I could get a little bit of help with navigating how to be a mom. The first person I met at the Life Center was Megan. I had no idea who she was and she came running up to me. She gave me a humongous hug. You know, all these women coming together and they're here with open arms and willing to help you out and know about you and know about your story. Having the support, having the friends, just knowing that I have people behind me if I'm ever out of diapers, if I'm out of wipes, that we have somebody that's gonna at least provide for us in that way. And it's not about just saying no, but walking with our young men and women, supporting them in their choice to say yes. And I think that's the strength of the Life Center as I, as I see it today. And it's a beautiful gift that the Life Center gives to the community and the, the community really does respond and wanting to be a part of this as well. Life Center of Santa has helped me immensely. As a young father, not knowing really what to expect, they've really helped me be more strong in fatherhood, of kind of giving an idea of what to go into and expect, as well as what my role should be and how to handle the new life that has uh, come up onto me. We no longer look at this whole relationship as it's just being about this unborn baby, but about developing the relationship with the mother and father and bringing them back into a life of faith, a life of community, because we are pro-life, we are pro-birth, and we are pro-salvation. I felt very included in the programs with just being able to be so involved with young fathers and offering support any way possible that I can give. It's not only changed my life, but also Michael's life and her daughter's life because she now has two parents that are able to have resources and somebody to talk to. And for that, I am eternally grateful. And I think that one day when our daughter grows up and asks us how we did it, it's all going to come back to this place. It's like living in a dark hole and coming to see the light at the end of the tunnel, walking into Life Center. You feel everybody being so friendly and so supportive, and that's when in reality, you really do think about, okay, well, I'm gonna choose life.